Welcome back. Greetings! One week remains until the next full moon. Additionally, the lost are increasing in number. I recommend continuing to assess the situation for any potential irregularities. Alright, so a lot to do here. Uh, go to the club escapade, do the rarity fortune. So we can finally knock that out. Go to Tartarus, save the people that are missing, and then uh, try out Ken, right? One more week until the next full moon. The situation remains unpredictable. Please begin making careful preparations now. I feel like uh, I will be sure to check all my parts as well. Can I help you? So Nada Senpai has been acting a little strange lately, don't you think? Maybe it's difficult for him to watch Amadaka and put himself in danger. Despite appearances, I think that deep down inside, the Nada Senpai is actually a really kind person. What do you mean besides appearances? He's so nice to us. Just wondering, does everyone do any weapon training? I should practice on my own to get the hang of fighting better, shouldn't I? Okay, I'll start today then. Very diligent. Junpei's being weird again. He's just going on about something he's super into. Well, maybe just for a day. He should be super into getting his homework done. Yeah. <laughs> ah, about Amada. Would you mind looking after him for me? Sure. Why, was, why would I be a dick and be like, yeah, I don't really want to. <laughs> yeah, that's not for me, Chief. You, you got that one. Good, I'm counting on you. Hey, is there anything you can think of that I'm super into? That's for you to discover. Yeah, you're right. I have to figure out it out on my own, too. Maybe he's talking about his experience with the girl? Because remember, the girl was saying that she just, Oh, I just want to draw, that's it. But, like, she's into it. She's doing it all the time. That we've seen, anyways, right? So, it does make sense. Alright, so we're definitely going to Club Escapade. I don't know why I used the door. I don't know what I'm thinking here. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead. Club Escapade. We'll do the rarity. Oh, not the monk. Not the monk. So my fortune. Finally do this rarity one. Then let us begin. I see it. If you go to the Tower of Shadow tonight, you are destined to face an adversary clad in gold. The chance of encountering rare shadows will increase when exploring Tartarus. Let us help you find fortune in your destiny. Okay. Sounds good to me. Is there anyone outside, like the gourmet maybe? No, but Tan uh, Tanaka's here. Hey. Oh, there you are. We ran through a bit of a snag again. Some of the other investors decided to drop out. Ah, okay. Alright. Okie dokie. <laughs> But since there are few investors, everyone will make even more, or because there are few investors, everyone will make even more of a profit. So would you mind investing some more? It's 10,000 more. That should be plenty. Are you in? Sure. I give the man 10,000 yen. My foolish little apprentice. Have you not realized that you are being deceived? Everything I've said has real clearly been suspicious. <sighs> Ignorance should be a crime. Sure, you have some redeeming qualities, but if you remain this naive, everyone will take advantage of you. Stick with me and I'll show you how to be a winner. The man seems to be serious. Did I spend some time hearing him out? Oh, but we just spent the money, bro! We just spent the money! Hey, wait, we give my 10 back! <laughs> my 10k back! He just, like, admitted to scamming me. Fuck it, let's unlock the Tanaka thing. We'll do the thing tomorrow. We'll do <laughs> we'll do the, the Tartarus run tomorrow. You insist, I'll give you my autograph. It's always a pleasure to meet a fan. Oh, there you go. So that's how we get it for, um, what's her name? Elizabeth. Who are you? <laughs> you look familiar. Oh, my. So very difficult being famous. Oh, my God. I go anywhere without being recognized. I'm sure you've seen the home shopping program, Tanaka's Amazing Kamada. Yes? Allow me to introduce myself. Ah, oh, here we go. He already had one prepped. The man handed me a business card. It says Tanaka, President and CEO. That's right. I'm Tanaka himself. Surely you've heard the name. I'm afraid I can't offer any returns on your 40,000 yen. But I've autographed my business card. Bro, he's actually trolling. What the fuck? We don't even get our money back. It'll be worth a pretty penny in a year or so. Uh, and with that, <laughs> I must be going. What a fucking troll, bro. <laughs> what the hell? Tanaka's signature, so that's what we need for a little bit. And that's it? That's where it ends? That little brat. Doesn't he realize he's in the presence of a star? Oh my god. Money. 
especially mine. Should have squeezed a few more payments out of them. Damn. Hey, fuck. It sounds like he's talking about me. Fuck him. Nah, fuck that. Nah, what you want? What you want then? Say it. <clears throat> what do you want? Quit disturbing me. Get out of here. Shoo. You? You overheard me talking to myself just now, didn't you? You'll forget it ever happened if you know what's good for you. I belong to a powerful talent agency. Oh I'm my god. A celebrity. I have an image to maintain. Don't even think about telling someone that I took your money or called you a little brat, capiche? Oh my god. Whatever you say. Ah, don't get cute with me. You think you can get away with anything with that pretty face of yours? Hey yo? <laughs> so hey what? Uh, Silly me. I've let you in on my little secret, haven't I? Hey, what's going on, Nathan Rose? Appreciate you dropping by today, man. Uh, don't tell anyone, okay? Wait. Uh, don't get cute with me. You think you can get away with anything with that pretty face of yours? Oh. <laughs> Silly me. I've let you in on my little secret, haven't I? Uh, don't tell anyone, okay? Is he trying to say what I think he's trying to say? <laughs> nah, Tanaka did not just accidentally out himself right there, did he? No, no, I don't believe it. Please, your shoes clean if you want me to. <laughs> what is happening? What is going on? Hey, hey, how have you been recently, Nathan? I appreciate you dropping by. What's been going on with you? All right, I don't care. <laughs> All right. Did, really? Did you promise? You better be ready to cross your heart and hope to die if you're lying to me. Oh my god. A verbal agreement is a form of contract. And if you breach it, I'll sue your pants off. Oh my your god. Adorable little face etched into my memory. Hey, yo. <laughs> he seems to have taken an interest in me. I'm now acquainted with Tanaka, the producer of the Home Shopping TV show. Damn, he's kind of an asshole, huh? He's kind of a major asshole. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create the persona of the devil. The devil arcana. Ah, okay. Rank up. Rank one devil. Businessman. You're a diamond in the rough, my boy. All you need is a little polishing. You'll sparkle. I don't like you using that polishing word. I'm not going to lie. I'm, just, I'm not going to lie about that one. I'm just looking into some hook music for my next single. <laughs> oh, cool. I often take my breaks here. I'd be happy to mold your young mind whenever you wish. Oh, dude, I don't, I don't know about this guy. <laughs> Some son of major suspicious. <laughs> nah, he's so suspicious. I mean, he was already scamming us. At parting ways with President Tanaka, I decided to return to the door. Now this guy's wild, bro. Oh, a Tartarus event? Yeah, prison kid. I thought I'd remind you. There's only a week left until the next full moon. Right, I forgot he does do that every time there's a week. There are only a few trials left. There's only three or four, so right? Make sure to be careful out there. I'll see you again sometime. <clears throat> Sounds good to me. Sounds pretty dope. One week to do everything we need to. Summer vacation's ending, shopping show's on. An irritatingly catching song comes from the speaker. Hello everyone, welcome to the Home Shopping Show, Tanaka's Amazing Commodities. I'm your host, Tanaka, with a live presentation of my amazing commodities. We'll show you great products at unbeatable prices, so don't touch that dial because you won't want to miss these. To Today, we're introducing the Sutra Set to ward off evil spirits. Have you felt a chill down your spine? Do you feel like something's been following you? First up, we have the Fear Sutra. 
and you get three of them. Chant this sutra to dispel evil spirits clinging onto you. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful, but wait, there's more. We'll throw in this depleting sutra too, guess how many? Three. All of this for 10,000 yen available today only. Go ahead and pick that up. I don't see why not. How about the fear sutra for 9,800 yen? Thanks, Next time we'll be having a sale on luxury brands. Don't miss it. Those sound like gifts. Thanks. Uh, that's it for today. For all sold out. Goodbye. We'll see you next Sunday. Same time, same channel. And we should be able to hang out with Maya here. Yep. The chat box is blinking. Looks like Maya wants to play Innocent Sin. And it looks like we might grow closer, which is perfect. I'll spend the day playing online games. I don't. I, it's really hard for me to discern what Maya wants, though, like when the dialogue options come up. I'm in Shinagawa Dungeon. I see Maya. Listen, Tatsuya. Nowadays, I just log into the MMOs with Bedhead and all. Like today. But when I was little, people said I was a real cutie. Guess I missed my chance, right? Nobody thinks I'm hot no more. Or anymore. The men only want younger women. Be honest. What are you talking about? Age isn't the point. Well, yeah. Age isn't the point. Maybe age isn't the point? Because this does seem like an older lady. Oh, we only got one. Ah, oh, damn it. That's what I'm talking about. You really get me. What's really important is true love. But but I think I tend to like them on the younger side too, though. Uh-oh. Maya seems very happy. <laughs> By the way, I'm make, if, am I making any sense? I hope so, because I teach composition. Okay, I'll, I'll be calm. I'll compose my bitching carefully for you. Oh my god. One of my co-workers is really pissing me off. I'm trying to avoid her. We used to teach the same grade, and we were together all the time. It's been a while, but that kind of thing sticks with you, you know? Anyway, she said she needed some advice, but that she started bragging. She just started bragging. Some student asked her out, and a guy she didn't like proposed to her. Wow, so she's talking- isn't she talking about Tomochika? Right? Is that what she's maybe referring to? I'm not jealous, it's just so freaking annoying, oh my god. I hate stinking hoes like, oh my god. Just give the puppy dog eyes and guys will do whatever. She even stuffs her bra a lot. Ooh. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. Maya is spilling all sorts of tea. She, um, what? <laughs> she, she, um, what? <laughs> oh, no bonus. Oh, we did get a bonus. I'm afraid you know too much now, Tatsuya. But that's right, she got faked. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> no shot. Oh my god. Okay, for real though, keep this between you and me, okay? Maya seems to be enjoying herself. Dude, Maya's chill. <laughs> I swear, oh my god. I saw Miss K run it, uh, running in late one time, right? And uh, her pads fell down and it looked like she had four. Oh my god, no. They're fake for sure. The school is full of teachers like that. Her pads fell down and she looked like she had four. Oh my god. Man, Tetsuya talking to you is better than getting a massage. Wait, what? Wait, wait, okay, I guess. Planning online is now an important part of my days off. <laughs> Maya seems to be talking to me, or seems to like talking to me. I feel like we're growing closer. Rank up. Rank 7 Hermit Online Game. We're supposed to be fighting demons from hell, right? But after what I just said, I might go to hell anyway. <laughs> uh, well, I rented some DVDs, so later to see you. Thanks for chatting. Maya's player signed off. I decided to log out as well. That was a crazy one for sure. <laughs> that was wild. Oh my god. I wonder if we're actually gonna like, like, realize who this teacher is at the end. Get any studying done? It looks like there have been more of those, uh, more of them lately, right? You call them the Lost, right? I don't mean to be rash, but I like to put my own power to good use. Right? Uh, so today we should go to Tartarus then. Now that I've officially joined and learned what's really going on, I've changed my perspective. This is a job only we can do. Can I help you? Let's talk. So now the senpai has been acting a little strange lately, don't you think? Maybe it's difficult for him to watch Armada put himself in danger. Yeah, we already said this one. In that case. He seems very determined. Normally, I would think of a di- Okay, same thing with her as well. That's gonna be planting. 
So again, let's go over to um, Polonia. And then we'll go do the rarity. Let's just double check that it was the rarity one. Because I don't want it to be the wrong one, right? Marvelous. We got some more Twilight Fragments, which is huge. I'm going to assist you uh, about requests. Do we have any? The person's autograph, right. Oh my. Mm, it says here Tanaka's amazing commodities. It must be a prominent figure's autograph. I must say he was very beautiful penmanship. He must be as powerful as the rumors say. This man who rambles along to a unique Marvelous. melody. Oh, I see that you've acquired a new bond in your addition to the autograph. That is a very good news indeed. Please take this as your reward and it will play cool. Let's see. Um, There was... Where is it? Fortune Teller. Rarity Fortune. Yes. Okay, there we go. So we'll definitely be able to do it here. So let's see here. We need the rarity. Rarity fortune. Beautiful. Yes, please. Three more days until Peacemaker. Nice, man. I know you've been genuinely excited for... Um, Peacemaker to come out, so you're it's right there, man. You just gotta wait three more days. And now we can go back to the dorm and hit up Tartarus, which, by the way, I'm definitely gonna save right now in case we ever need to come back and grind. I can do that off stream here if the boss is too tough, but I don't think he's gonna be. I think we're gonna be okay. Um, let's go to Tartarus. All right, then let's meet in the usual place. I'll let the other know. See you there. Nice. Nice. Oh, excuse me. Oh, he looks dripped out in his, uh, his CV uniform. Will you please add me as a member in today's search party? For sure. I want to participate in lots of battles and get used to handling my persona. I wonder what it looks like. Okay. All right. I hope I can prove myself useful to all of you. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, yes. Now have a moment of your time. Tartarus appears to have a special little guest today, and between its jaws is clenched a fragment that emitted a curious blue light. Should your curiosity get the best of you, perhaps it'd be best to pay this guest a visit. I believe you'll find them on 80, a floor 88. Um. Don't worry about me. Something like Tartarus doesn't scare me at all. Please bring me with you for tonight's exploration. Hmm. Tedos will attack anyone, even children. I'm impressed with Amada. He seems to join, or he asked to join our group, even though he knows the risk. Here we go. Hmm. Amada's just in elementary school, but he's so determined. It's kind of amazing, you know. Me, on the other hand, you know, you're gonna need my help. We good to go? Hmm. I can't believe Amadakun's gonna be fighting with us now. I don't really know how I feel about this, but he volunteered himself. So, wanna get going? Oh my god, I forgot she got the sexy, like, battle uniform or something, right? Amada is still a novice in basic combat, so we must support him. As a team leader, I expect you to instruct him properly. Would you like for me to accompany you? So it looks like she's kind of got... It, it looks like Yukari's battle panties, but it's just in black and gold, which are a pretty cool colorway, I'm not gonna lie. Um, so let's go ahead and equip her back to her normal, because I kept forgetting to, like, check on it every time. It's a uh, season of yes. I guess. Amada son is very young but appears to have no difficulty summoning and using his persona. Therefore, age does not seem to influence the power of a persona. Shall we depart immediately? Wait, let me read that again. Yes. Ah, okay. So, age has no bearing on it, basically. Amada can sure is amazing, isn't he? Even though he's so young, he's really determined. It makes me want to do my best to support him. I'll support you all from here. Is there anything I could do for you? Let's check our progress. I believe the highest floor you've gotten is 118. We've managed to get as far as we can for the time being. I guess we can say mission accomplished. Great job, everyone. So we gotta go to floor 88, they said. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We gotta um, fix our party. So I guess for Amaru, let's... Let's get rid of I guess for now and let's put Ken in. His SP seems to be on the lower side, kind of like Junpei, so maybe he'll be like a physical attacker too. Alright, let's do it. So, floor 88, huh? So that's right here. Damn. I, have, I had a rarity fortune red today. Apparently I will face an adversary clad in gold. Maybe I'll run into some rare enemies. I'm getting a fate reading of a person. It could be on the, uh, one of the lost. We're counting on you, Koro-chan. Alright, so let's see what Ken's like. 
should be a kid, but I'll catch up to all of you in no time. I'm actually kind of thinking I might be wrong, but I, I think he might be like a healer slash attacker because um, we haven't really gotten anyone that's been a specialty in healing besides Yukari. The fortune teller, yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see one up ahead already. <laughs> Yeah. So he's got the dark AOE. Let's do that. Oh, the hand doesn't take the AOE damage. Oh shit, I didn't know that. Oh, he takes only physical, I think I remember, right? Let's do our big boy then. Or did we fuse him? I think we fused him. Oh shit. Yeah, we did fuse him. Oh, we don't have the big boy anymore. A miss, too. Wow, we suck. Look into my eyes. What is this guy's weakness? I don't remember. Nothing, really. We haven't tried light. Okay, now we get to see what he's like. All right. Okay, so he's got... Whoa, <laughs> Look at where he's aiming that gun, bro! <laughs> Alright, so Zayanga, medium electric to one foe. Light, or, or healthy light damage to one foe, that's pretty good. Moderately restored HP, party's HP, see, he is kind of like a healer, and he's got a good diversification, so not bad. Maka, Maka Rakarn, erect a barrier for one ally that repels non almighty magic attacks, that's pretty good. Dekaja, nullify stat bonuses for all foes. So he's kind of like the more magical version of Igis, I would say. Okay, let's try the light. And that's his weakness? I can't tell. Oh, it is his weakness. Oh, shit. What did he say? Nemesis? Well, I know it's not. It just did the animation, but he's he wasn't weak to it. I mean, we've done no damage to this thing, so it's definitely getting away. And we don't have physical attackers really here. Yeah, I mean, is there a way for us to just... Yeah, we'll just guard. Make it pass faster. Oh, wow. She did a lot of damage, actually. Oh, we almost killed it. If I would have not guarded with Koromaru, we would have done it. Oh, shit. I guess our level gap maybe is what did it. Okay, so we got to get to 88. We're at 84 right now. Full chest. Onyx is not bad. We need topazes. Remember, topaz is what we're really needing here. Let's both do our best, Koromaru. Dun. I don't know. I really don't know who I prefer to have on my team. Honestly, I'm thinking of a combo of like Ikari, I guess, and either Koromaru or Ken right now. Because Ken has really good coverage. Koromaru is really good against Dark, and he has Fire, which is also decent coverage as well. So it's like, it's really up in the air, like, you could use either one and it'll be good. Hmm. Gives me a lot to think about when comprising my team together, you know? Let's get the chest over here. This isn't the one that we saw, though. Revival Bead's not bad. Definitely could use that. So I end up spending a surprising amount of money on them. There we go. Here's the box. We got... Beast Leggings. Whoa. For a female. Getting up the stairs pretty fast. Looks like we can head up. 87, so we're one away from whatever is at 88. Or whoever, right? Patra Gem. I've heard that during the Sengoku era. Many warlords use spears too. Mmm. Okay. Sounds like a history factoid that that teacher would know about. The one who was just obsessed with samurais, right? We attack. All right. So here we go. Made it to the floor. It's a cat. Okay. So Elizabeth was basically telling us that this thing uh, has a uh, twilight fragments in its mouth too. Oh, Don't really know which way we're supposed to go. This one's a complex so one. She's a lifesaver. I'm glad to be of help. Was the size okay? 
I think Korochan found something. A box. One of the, like, the, yeah, I was gonna say the antique ones. Soul drop is not bad at all. Looks like that one will be tough to beat. Ah. Uh, looks like we gotta go down and right maybe where that chest is. I think that might be where it's at. It's over here. I bet we'll find something good in there. Let's open it up. No, but we got the antibiotic gel. Look, okay, so maybe we go to the right from the beginning there, right? Let's go ahead and check that place out. Over here. Over there. This way. This one looks like a dead end, though. Ooh, a treasure chest. Oh, gold chest, though. That's not bad. Amethyst. I'll take that. And here he is. Okay. Cool. There's a cat that looks like it's scowling. Huh, there's a kitty in a place like this? Anyway, we need to protect it. Please come back to the entrance immediately. So there should be an actual person in here, though, as well. So hopefully Elizabeth tells us that when we get back. Welcome back. Good day. Let's see. About missing person. I, I sense someone. There seems to be a human from 106 to 111. Okay. Are you accepting oh, I don't oh, wait. We can report a thing? Hold up. Here are my requests. The fortune telling, right. Seems you completed a request. One moment, please, while I check. How is the outcome of the fortune telling? I see. So the predictions really did Very come true. Just who in the world is that fortune teller? I hope to meet them someday. Please take this as a reward. Defeat a rare shadow. We've done that as well. Oh my. Here's you've already completed it. Got some onyxes. All right, cool. So there's one. I want to try to do like another couple of them as well. We're close to a couple of them, so. And then, like, the moth one, I think we can do, but I just don't know the combinations for it. That's what I was saying, like, oh, okay, maybe we do that one, um, you know. Well, what was it? It was, like, 106 to 108, right? I was thinking maybe I do that one off stream just so I can, like, look it up and stuff and just get, I like, get through it. 106 to 111, okay. Very well. Alright, let's do that. Um... One oh, so here we go. Right here, perfect. Uh -huh. One oh nine is their floor, so they're not too far off. One oh six is where it really starts, because that first floor is always empty. So it's only two or three floors up ahead, which is nothing really. Boom, boom, boom. Woo. Okay, time to move on. Yes, it it's is. Do we attack? Straight well, shot here, not worry. too bad. I'm watching over you from here. You can proceed at your own pace. Yes, he did. Go ahead and keep going. I'm not calling it quits just yet. Ugh, tough to know when it branches out like this. Shadows sometimes hide in areas that are hard to see. There so we go. For and then this is 108 or 109? 108. So we need one more. Nothing. There's where we came from. Here's the chest. We almost don't have enough to start unlocking these chests, man. There's so many. Fuck. Daft jacket. The daft hey. punk. I could use the new armor even if it doesn't fit now. I'll definitely grow into it. Give it to him. Why not? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. There's another one with one. Oh, they're draining our twilight fragments, man. Armand, Armada Buster? Is that a oh, Bustier? Right, it was the Bustier Looks thing. Like we can head up. The hell? My sound was cutting out there. Oh, this guy looks weird. Getting a reading of a person. Please go rescue them. Oh, there's a treasure chest. So there's a chest and the missing person. Dang, this one is big. Jeez. There's the stairs. Get over here. Nothing too crazy in this area. And here's the person. Where's the chest, though? Oh, shit.
Ah, it's gonna be over there on the right. Go get it real quick. No, it's not here. What's the plan? Where is this damn thing? <laughs> there it is. Found it. Homunculus. Hey, that was actually really worth the detour. Actually, the homunculus is huge, and a gold chest too. Black quartz. Hey, not bad. Actually, a really good detour here. Let's go ahead and get back to the missing person, and then we'll be good to get out of here. Over here, I think, right? Yeah, okay. Over here. Planning to make a rap or a hip-hop single, which is going to be insane. Hey, man, the best of luck in your endeavors. I hope it pops off and it goes well. That must be one of the people who went missing. There we go. Let's see if this was the last guy or if there's another one. Welcome back. We can save, uh, we keep them safe for now. I tried another search, but I'm still not picking up anyone else's presence inside. It seems we've rescued everybody who accidentally ended up in Tartarus. Perfect. So now let's save in case, um, we need to come back and, like, grind or anything. But for now, we're good to go. Let's call it quits. I doubt we're under leveled for any of the bosses coming up, but you never know. You know, it's better to be safe than sorry. So we'll try to keep that save open. Now we have a couple days. Oh, here we go again. Hey, fancy meeting you here, huh? Oh, forgot to press X. You're the one who keeps coming back. <laughs> you too. You get into the same bench. You from around here? Oh, not even listening, huh? <laughs> Here's. Damn, she's just leaving? Fuck. Whoa, what the fuck? Whoa, your hand! What the hell happened? You're bleeding! What's wrong with you? Can't you mind your own business? What the heck? Are you kidding? I can't just ignore that. Nah, uh, gotta have something. Give me your hand. I can wrap it up with this handkerchief. Why are you panicking? Huh? Who wouldn't be freaking out right now? You gotta get to a doctor. Uh, do you want me to go with you? You're a weird one. Chidori. Huh? My name. You asked, didn't you, Junpei? I'm almost finished with the drawing. I doubt you'll be able to understand it. But if you want to see it so badly, then you know where to find me. Hmm. You know what I'm thinking? You know what I'm thinking? She is drawing in blood. Oh, dude, that's fucked up if she is. Oh, shit. That is going to be a crazy revelation once Junpei finds out. Oh, damn. Okay. Holy, okay, I'm getting a little bit more invested in that plot line now, too. Today is the last day of summer vacation, and the film festival ends today as well. Maybe I should invite someone from the dorm to go with me. Oh, damn. Alright, so we should meet up with the officer. We haven't gotten new gear in a while, and we can get our, um, like, our for saving the people. We can get our rewards. You rescued her, right? I won't ask questions, just take it. We got Divine Grace. I've never heard of that one. There's still more. Kills rocks with a strange pattern on them. The man they found the other day left them. I'm fine with one or two, but this many just gets in the way of our work. You saved him, didn't you? Just go ahead and take them all. The mal oh, wow! 20 Malachite. That's crazy. I don't have that much, but you should be able to find what you need. Um, I'm thinking of armor. Is there any good armor we can buy? Robe of Warding. A robe of fashion with sorcery that conjures up an invisible shield. So these are all ores for us, actually. Wow. What about Ken? Got Can we get him anything? You might find useful. So feel free to... Uh -huh. What are you looking for? Cyber shoes. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Um, isn't Yukari susceptible? Is she susceptible to, um... Uh, what is it? Lightning? Because there were some lightning shoes. I wouldn't mind picking up some lightning shoes for her. Hold on. Uh, Persona? No. That's... Let's look at Yukari. Oops, wrong one. Uh, how do we look at her Persona? Right trigger. Yep, she's susceptible to lightning. Perfect. So we'll actually get her, um, those lightning shoes, I think. That way she's, uh, not 
gonna end up well, getting like got. Thunder Zori was this shock. See if anything catches There's no Zori adorned with the Thunderbolt pattern. Good here. Good. Just flip it down. And don't sell the old ones, just in case. All done here. Alright. And let's see, they have a new burger. I don't really care about that right now. Uh, let's talk to this dude. There's more of those creeps again. I know they'll start disappearing again soon, but it's still creepy. So let's go to the dorm and see if anyone wants to hang out. If no one does want to hang out, though, we'll go to the shrine and up our Maya bond. Let's see. I don't. Uh, I have plans today. I'll be back before it's dark, though. Keeping busy with work suits me more than being idle. I found it hard to pass time yesterday since I had nothing to do. So I decided to take a nap, which actually gave me a headache. That does happen sometimes. And I was in a good mood to go to the movies. Uh, today's the last day of summer vacation, right? Well, since it is, I was wondering if you had any plans today. I just wanted to ask. No reason. I think Amato wants to say something. Us? Uh, yeah, if he, if no one else wants to, we'll hang out. Keep us still fooling around. You better get started on that homework or he'll be in real trouble. As for me, I'm all done. I've got so much stuff I gotta catch up on now that I have free time again. I feel that, man. Charlie seems to have already made plans. I doubt she's in the mood for the movies. I guess did say something about maybe... Uh, what do you call it? About going to the movies? But I guess we missed our chance, because it was only that one day, right? Summer vacation will end soon. This dorm will become quieter once everyone's back at school. I'm thinking of ways to remain at your side from September onwards. How much do you want to bet she's going to put on a school uniform and follow us to class? <laughs> How much do you want to bet? Let's hang out with Ken. I feel bad that he's like, oh, baby, oh, you know, and doesn't want to say it. Sure. Mata looks happy. Superhero crossover collection. Huh. So that's what they're showing today. That sounds dope. The monster that poster is from Amoeba Man. Amoeba Man? Uh, it's not like I'm super excited about it or anything. Oh, yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> of course you're not. I was just bored, and I thought it would pass the time. Of course, yeah, yeah, me too, me too. Oh, no, it's starting. Quick, we gotta get good seats. Yeah, for Amoeba Man. The Amoeba. Oh. Wings of the Night. I feel like I've seen the heroes transform hundreds of times. It makes me feel as if I can transform myself. Ah, see, we got courage points. Okay, so they don't, like, reallocate courage points that would otherwise go to other stats. That was just getting lucky with hitting all the other stats with movies, I guess. <laughs> he likes it, man. to shoot out a laser beam just in the nick of time and then the bad guys yo amoeba man sounds lit hold up uh, anyways uh, some of the scenes were pretty good he's trying to seem all mature and everything but it's all just make-believe anyways oh come on man just live with your enthusiasm <laughs> for your passion there's no wrong in that i've always hated when people like try to make fun of you for something you're really interested in or really, really enthusiastic about, right? That's always irked me the wrong way for forever. I remember in like middle school or high school, uh, people would do that, not particularly to me a lot, because I always had friends that were into the same stuff I was, but I would always hear someone like talk about their interests like in the classroom setting or something, and then their friends would be like, you're such a nerd, or like, why are you getting so excited? It's just a movie or a game or whatever. And I was always like, dude, that's so stupid. Like, you have, I'm sorry, but your friend is being a real asshole right now, you know? Like, I wouldn't say it, it would be in my thoughts though, and it's like, damn, like, that person's genuinely excited about a topic and you're making them sound like they're a complete asshole for just like saying how excited they are. That always rubbed me the wrong way with people when they do that. That was a lot of fun. Thank you for inviting me. Aww. I went back to the dorm with Amada. Nice. Oh, it's you. Welcome oh. back. The moon will be full again soon. I'm sure this goes without saying by now, but please make sure you're adequately prepared. So I'm actually also wondering if you have to 
make it to the roadblock by the end of the full moon. I mean, I've just been kind of passively doing it, but I wonder what happens if you don't go to it, um, or if you don't make it there by the next full moon. Is it like a game over? Um, kind of like if you didn't do the palaces in time? Maybe. Amada-san is small, so he uses a spear with long reach. This enables him to compensate for his small statue and fight bigger enemies. Indeed, a spear is the perfect weapon for Amada-san. School starts up again tomorrow. Has Junpei-san caught up on his homework? Doesn't he seem like he's spacing out more often? Oh, my homework's all done, of course. I knocked it out in July. That's just par for the course. <laughs> Did Junpei finally give up on finishing his homework? He looks kind of out of it. I wonder if he's alright. Hmm. Chidori, huh? All things considered, she's a bit of a weirdo. <laughs> TV remote at Koromaru's feet. You know what? Yeah, let's let's hang out with Koromaru here. Let's hang out with Koromaru. Let me go ahead and uh, answer some messages real quick. It's another episode of that docu-series about a wolf pack. In this one, a mischievous wolf pup is playing with his father. Aww. Aww, no. Aww, that's so cute. So sad. He's like, I wanna, you know, I wanna be with my dad. Romaro seems kind of sad. Aww. Hold up. He's just all disappointed. What's wrong? Do you miss your parents? Aww. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, my two oldest dogs, you know, they're they're old, man. They're 12 years old, I think, at this point. Which is, you know, pretty up there, luckily, you know. And uh, they were both from the same litter. They're brothers. And uh, I remember they actually saw their mother... I think it was like a year after when they like after we had because we purchased them off like uh, my mom's friend or something. And so we like they they brought over the mother to like just kind of hang out like while they were there. And it was oh man, they were so happy that day, man. They ah oh, they were just running around like crazy. They were playing the whole day. It was ah oh, they had so much fun, man. Koromaru seems fixated on the scene with his eyes, or his eyes hold of a, tra a trace of longing. Jesus. I wonder if he misses his parents. Watching how animals live in the wild helped me improve my academics. The poor dog, yeah. Aw, he, he just wants to, you know, he just wants to be his family again. Looks like there's more to this documentary series on wolves. Maybe I'll watch it with Koromaru again whenever I have the time. All right, so here we go. It's back to school, right? That means we might be able to finally finish the Miyamoto track team uh, social link. The second semester begins today. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I think we've heard this song before, but I don't remember for what, right? Okay. All right. <laughs> I can hear people talking, yo, this soundtrack slaps! Good morning, summer vacation is over. What a bummer, why does they suck? In that case. <laughs> Sounds like somebody has apathy syndrome. Oh, wouldn't life be easier if you actually did? What? No, do I really? On second thought, you're right, it doesn't sound too bad. At least I wouldn't have to worry about anything. Didn't we hear this soundtrack earlier? I think we did, I just don't remember for what. People are getting used to apathy syndrome. Some people seem to think it's awful, but others think it's not so bad. Yo, we need more of this song, bro. This shit slapped. The first bell has rung. Dude, this is so good. I like that. I like that a lot. Alright, quiet down. Summer vacation's over. You're back in school now, so act accordingly. We'll never get through the full textbook if you stay on vacation mode forever. So... Okay, let's review. Which property of electricity is relevant to superconductivity? Voltage, resistance, current. Superconductivity? It's gotta be voltage or current, but... If I had to guess for superconductivity... A 
current? That would be my guess. I, that would be what I would choose out of those three. It's resistance. Wow. Okay, I was completely wrong. Even even my guesses. Resistance. Yeah, that's, right. that's right. Been studying, I see. Anything that reaches an electrical resistance of zero at a characteristic temperature is considered superconducting. Ah, okay. I didn't know that. As a result, electric currents can travel eternally through a superconductive circuit held at a proper temperature. Many years ago, I used to f I used this fact to confess my love to someone. What? My love for you was superconductive, I told them. Damn, you fucking- you took that fat L, didn't you? Sure enough, my enthusiasm won her over and we started dazing. Nah, that's cap. <laughs> He's cap, isn't no way. But enthusiasm isn't very scientific. Before too long, I'd lost interest in her. Alright, in the next section... Damn, so you're saying he was, he was the one who lost interest. Okay. I answered correctly. Everyone in class is looking at me with respect. So this charm or academic? Charm, okay. Alright. And the music's still going, too. It hasn't stopped. Class has ended for today. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Everyone's back. Everyone came crawling back. But real quick, I need to see Miyamoto. Yo. Sup? You heading to practice today? I don't think our bomb will grow any stronger, even if I spend more time with Miyamoto. See, I'm thinking more gate kept then, right? So I spend time after school with the track team. It sounds like no matter what we do, we're kind of time locked. Dude, how are you gonna keep my level if you're slacking? Yo. You're heading to practice today. I don't think our bond will grow any stronger, even if I spend more time with Miyamoto. What does this mean? I I'm, I'm getting confused. Let's do another one just to be safe, right? About quitting the club, I feel like you deserve an explanation. I feel like I might go closer. I feel like I might go closer. We haven't done any of the Justice one. Maybe we'll do Fushimi. Ramen, ramen, ramen. I feel like I might grow closer. Let's do Tomo Chica, actually. I haven't done him in a while. We'll do Tomo. Oh, you want to grab ramen, right? Sure. Looks like Tomo Chica wants to hang out, and we'll get closer. Let's do it. All right, let's go. Guess I'll get myself an extra large special. That sounds delicious right now, man, with an egg. Ooh. Just like that? Why? Why? I forgot I have to go check out that cram school today. Sorry, man. Ah. No cap. For ramen today. Big cap, I know it. I mean, getting into college is pretty important, don't you think? You think about the future too, right? I've got plans already. Yeah, more than you do. Not even a little. <laughs> I've got plans already. Oh, dude. I didn't know you were so serious about your future. <laughs> I never really thought about my future until Emiri told me I should. She said I'd end up a loser if I didn't. But the future's a long way off. I mean, I still have to go to college first, right? Apparently, a bunch of Emiri students go to good colleges. Ah. We must be thinking about our future together. Oh my god. <laughs> you ought to think about your future too, man. I'd hate to see you end up becoming a loser, you know? <laughs> Fuck! My bad, me! Fuck me, God! I'd hate to see you become a fucking loser! That's why we gotta work our asses off. For our futures. Oh my god. Alright, Tomochika seemed to be sincerely worried about my future. I feel like relationship is stronger. I mean, it's for the weirdest reasons, but okay. Yeah, thank you, Tomochika. Later, I'm heading to cramp school. Alright. I went back to the dorm by myself. Damn, it's almost been two hours already. Holy. I'm going by quick. Oh, there he is. Only four days left. That does it for a first day back. Yeah, I bet. Always exhausting. You two have perfect timing. Perfect timing? For what? Hey, Fuka! Is I guess ready? Oh my, here we go. That's what I was talking about. Yup, look at that. I knew it. Huh? Why is she wearing a school uniform? What's going on here? <laughs> she said she wanted to go to school with us. 
so I told the others as a joke. But the chairman actually agreed, so now she's gonna start as a second year tomorrow. Isn't this a little bit too risky Seriously? to learn that she He's might be a that? robot, dude? He said something about studying her behavior in a social environment. They're doing the most to explain this, but it's really, like, really, it, it, there was no way that this would happen, right? If this was some sort of top secret shadow killing robot, there's just no shot that they'd let her just go to school. Sounds like him, all right. That, that's not the problem here. <laughs> well, if he's cool with it, then I guess it's all right. Besides, I'd say it looks pretty good on her. Maybe then. Oh my God, the school pays down tremendously bad. Is more than appropriate. The school camouflage. It looks very natural on you. No one will suspect a thing. But why do you want to go to school? It's not like it's interesting. As the second semester commences, I intend to synchronize my schedule with everyone for maximum efficiency. Ah. To accommodate, oh shit. I requested. If I remain here on standby, it could affect our deployment efficiency. That is kind of true. To accommodate. I requested reassignment alongside our squad leader. Because, like, if something happens at school or after school on our way and she's not there, then there's no way to have to Igus in the party. Alongside our squad leader. Deployment efficiency, huh? Why do I feel like you being at school would make that even worse? <laughs> I will make any necessary adaptations as the situation evolves. Uh, sure, you do that. He says, I want to go to school too. Oh my god. <laughs> Give him a uniform. <laughs> he's good. You definitely have to stay here, okay? No, he's fine. Just give him a C's uniform. Or a C's, a, a Gekkerken High uniform. He'll be, he'll be good. He'll be good. But I do think we're going to be time kept from the Miyamoto and the Bonchiki storyline. Because they both said the same thing of like, even if we spend time, it's not going to further, right? So... I think we're probably like it probably has to be like another month or something and then they'll let us do it I'm, I'm just not too sure looks like the product I ordered through the shopping program on TV has arrived let's see what's inside your sutra and the depleting sutra don't really know what they do it's kind of bottom let's check out what they do actually at the lifestone at the biotic gel where are the sutras soul drops are good oh soul drops are only 10 sp I thought they were 100 let's see Oh no, precious egg. Oh, fully restored? That's huge. Uh, where is it? Speed increase, revival beads. What does the Arch Odd Morsel do? 15 or 150 HP? Dang. I mean, we're gonna give that to the Gourmet eventually, but. Fear Sutra is party of the attack for three turns. That's huge. And Depleting Sutra is decrease of the attack of all foes for three turns. Wow, that's really good, actually. What the hell? Can I help you? Let's talk. Oh, hi. I gave Agus some winter clothes to wear so she's covered up. I hope she won't be too hot in them. Why? I have a question. Why can't Karamaru attend school? I don't understand why I'm permitted to go to school while Karamaru is not. Because he's a dog. <laughs> That's a negative. Nowhere in the school regulations of the state that canines are prohibited from attending school. Even Karamaru san seemed perplexed about this. <laughs> he let him know, like, hey, do you see this fine print? This don't make no sense. <laughs> Dude, let's be real. She's seriously cute. I bet she'll be super popular. Tons of guys are gonna have a crush on her. But what if someone finds out that she's, you know, the way she walks, the way she talks? <laughs> uh, when I guess wears a school uniform, she looks like your average high school student. Oh, I recommend I guess is attendance at school to the chairman. I guess requested that she attend, and I couldn't think of any reason why she shouldn't. The chairman agreed, so there you have it. I had nothing to do with this, alright? It was all Mitsuru. If anything happens at school, I'm not going to be held responsible for it. Well, what is the kids keep thinking? If she wears a summer uniform, everyone would be able to see her mechanical arms. So we decided she should wear a winter uniform. Wearing this in the summer is a little weird, but I don't think she... It's... She must be a robot weird, right? That's also true! Isn't that like a thing? Isn't it like you can't wear the other seasonal uniform when it's out of season? I thought that was a rule. Like, because they're heavily about their dress code. I, I don't know how that works. I don't know if you can wear off-seasonal stuff without, like, the teachers noticing and questioning you or trying to make you change into your other set of uniform, right? Uh, so, I, I don't know too much about that. Maybe you guys do. But, 
may, you know, I, I do find that weird. And I'm sure if she does make friends at school, they would also be like, hey, like, why are you wearing the old uniform and not the new one? You must be burning up, you know? <laughs> Congratulations, you won. Did that get your heart fluttering? Well, if you want to be successful in life, then come see me. Where am I? Hint. How? For Polonia Mall. Do not reply to this message. Please contact us through the official inquiry portal at Amazing <laughs> or at Amazing Commodities uh, Corp. <laughs> Alright, so let's meet with Tanaka here. No odd morsel dude yet, too. Hmm. Alright, let's talk to Tanaka. Oh, well if it isn't you. Are you busy at the moment? If not, I can teach you a valuable life lesson. Free of charge, of course. It seems like President Tanaka wants to talk to me. Let's do it. <laughs> My, aren't you enthusiastic? Then let's not waste any more time. My schedule is so terribly packed. I don't usually have time for your average joke. You, know? you should be glad you're such a handsome boy. Alright. Let's add a new word to our vocabulary today. Repeat after me. Placebo. Hmm. The stress is on the middle syllable. Placebo. Very good. You're feigning interest well. <laughs> a placebo is a pretend pill. Basically, it's a medicine to give you peace of mind. Yep. Imagine this. A supplement to eliminate those unsightly love handles without lifting a finger. Or a car navigation system that uses real-time image data to make your commute all the smoother. Or at least make it feel that way. These are just a fraction of our unique line of products. Wow. Can you even sell those? Just wow. I think that'll do it. <laughs> huh? Yep. You're really wowed by those bogus products? I suppose one could see them as rather spectacular. Our business doesn't provide tangible benefits. It provides peace of mind. Take emergency supplies, for example. People feel safe just because they have them, don't they? As it turns out, <laughs> the more money people spend, the better they feel. Now then, that's it for today's lesson. You can pay me back when you make your first million. Oh my god. <laughs> I received somewhat questionable advice from President Tanaka. I understand him a little better now. Is it like for you, man? Hey, man, I uh, greatly appreciate that. Again, it helps a lot with discoverability and everything, as I always say. So thank you a ton for helping me out with the like on the stream, man. Have you been keeping your promise? You didn't tell anyone, did you? If you go back on your word, you might be surprised to find your profile suddenly on an internet dating site. <laughs> okay. What the hell? It's getting late, so I'll be back to- or I'll be getting back to the dorm. There you go. We're almost there. The full moon is almost upon us. It's right there. I Music slaps. I see. This must be Tartarus during the daytime. That's right. Yes. Currently, I detect no shadows in the vicinity. However, we must remain cautious at all times. music slaps bro we have another new transfer student joining us today go ahead and introduce yourself my name is i guess i am pleased to meet you all i guess so i've never heard a name like that maybe she's a foreigner let's see anything else i should know hmm? humanoid tactical weapon oh my god why would she put that on her thing also, look, that hairstyle is definitely Maya's hairstyle, so it's a thousand percent this teacher. What? <laughs> I would. Clearly, that's a mistake. It just goes to show you can't believe everything you read. Yeah, you got that right. <laughs> They're trying to cover Let's up see. so bad. Can sit, um, are there any open seats? The battle music, yes, sir. There's a spot right next to him. Ah. Okay, off you go. Conveniently, there's a desk literally right next to me that I've never noticed. I, I, I genuinely don't know if that's always been there or not. I'm not gonna uh, cat. Miss Toriyumi, someone already sits there. He just ditched today. <laughs> Which means he's not here. 
so now it's yours. All right, take Bet. a seat. He just snitched today. What a snitch, Junpei. Damn, fuck. <laughs> he just fucking didn't the show up. Is perfect. My highest priority is to be with him at all times. For whatever reason. I guess... What is it? Uh, Yukari, why do you stand up? For real? What's wrong with you? Uh, why? Uh... <laughs> Good to see everyone's getting along so well. But do me a favor and save the drama for after class. Damn. Give me a break. <laughs> that was just so weird. Why would you stand right there, bro?